Hey, what's up, Chef Arm Baggy? How you guys doing today? What's up, Beft? How are you? Hopefully, OBS recognizes my Minecraft. There we go. All right. We're going to be doing this in single player. Also, I haven't tested to make sure my world edit mod works, but hopefully it does. <laughs> We're going to find out soon. Um, but first, I want to test something on realms. I want to see what the render distance is and how that works. Uh, works fine. It's all right. You're going to stream Origin Realms again? <laughs> Uh, we're not actually streaming Origin Realms, Beft. We're, we're doing something else today. <laughs> Alright. Hey, what's up, Turtle Dan? I'm doing well. How are you? Alright. Um, Y minus 60. I think it's actually two chunks. I think it was eight chunks before, wasn't it? Now it's 12. Um... Glad you're doing well. However, what I want to check... My game sounds working. There you go. Is how far vertically we can see. What's the build height? 320? Position is out of the world. world. Is it 319? There you go. Okay. <laughs> I didn't think about this. Um. So obviously we're not going to be able to make it to the top. Yeah. F3 doesn't show me the blocks. Lovely. Do you go higher faster? Yeah, you do, I think. All right, have a good one, Top. See ya. All right. Um, well, we're just going to look for the different wood colors and see which ones we can see from below. Oh, we can't even see the ground. Thanks, Creeper. Let's see how many of these we can see. Um, looks like just the first one. Can't even tell what block it is. I don't have Optifine installed. Uh, work was kind of busier than I expected, Sig, but it was fine. We managed. You need to use all your points for the challenge. Thanks, Sig. All right, so let's say we're about 117 blocks plus 60, so the height's going to be about 180 blocks. 10 or 12 chunks. It's 12 times 16, 180. 192. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. So, it's about 10 or 12 chunks. Basically, um, I'm trying to base how tall we can make the build. <laughs> Because I have a, a pretty wild idea for the lobby. Most people are probably going to end up hating it. What am I doing? Uh... So if we start at Y minus 60, we'll make it to about 120. So we need to remember. Is it a tree? Maybe. It's going to be tree-like. Okay. Well, let's hop into single player now. 
Create new world. Um, creative, a lot of cheats. Data packs, don't need those. Peaceful game rules. I don't remember which game rules I'm supposed to keep that on for now. a lot of trees um it's not gonna quite be a tree i think we'll see we'll see um hello bot goodbye bot turn off all those i don't think i want any drops Time of day off, update fire off, weather off. And tick speed three. Let's set that to zero for now. How should I get XP? XP for what? Disable raids on. Okay, that should be fine. More world options, super flat. Void. Bonus chest on. Joint structures off. All right. Nothing bad could happen? Hmm, I don't know about that. All right, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got two apples. It's GG. We've already won. I thought I made it so that that stuff didn't happen, but whatever. Essential mod? I don't even know what that is. I'm set. Uh, new. Trying to lower destruction chance in your unbreaking boots. I would say a finding an XP grinder and just vibe in there for a while, you know? Three counting you sig. Oh, <laughs> apples, I get it. Buy apples. Um to forest so the grass doesn't look bad. We can edit it with world edit, so that's not too big a deal. I should double check that world edit installed properly. Cause I never screw anything up. Yep. Slash slash replace uh grass block. You cool. It has a free glasses cosmetic. What? Why do you need a glasses cosmetic? Alright, um what well, why level are we at? That's something we should uh Okay, I want there to be space so we can go below. Um, so let's start at Y0 and go up 180 blocks. That sounds fine to me, or fine to you guys. <laughs> sounds fine to me. Um, let's do that. All right, and then slash set block at zero, zero, zero. Done. Cool. All right. So that's where we're going to start. We have space below and we're going to go up to. I need 180. No, we want to go higher. Another 64 blocks. Haha. <laughs> so it would be. You 44. Cannot set the block. Damn 
Yeah, we can just barely see it. <laughs> cool. Okay. Nice. Okay. So that's how tall the, the build's gonna be. At least that's the plan. We'll see if that actually happens. Um. Let's do slash slash set. Not biome. It's a uh, circle. Cylinder. Um. Stone. Shoot, how do the arguments for this work? 10, 1, air? Shoot. Mm hmm. Pattern? Oh, Jesus. It's been so long. Barely tell the stone is there. Yeah, indeed. Um, minus A makes it only target air, right? Stone, 10, 1. That'll do it. Okay. So let's uh, undo. Do that. Yeah, because that'll be Y0, right? Looking at Y0. Nice. And let's put a sea lantern there so it's easy to find. Cool. How people use world edit to build. Uh, let's make this a little bit bigger. Let's go with uh, radius 25. Be 50 blocks. Uh, let's do 20. I'll be fine. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Um, basically, kind of my idea, right? We're, I'm not going to go super into detail because I don't want to spoil plans. Um, but we're going to need a bunch of these different brushes probably won't need that many but you know uh the anime fan great what's up how's it going welcome to the stream did you change your name because i don't recognize your name or am i just dumb <laughs> sorry um no okay i might be dumb i'm sorry i have a bad memory basically okay so the idea for this build you're just <laughs> Aw, thanks, Sig. I appreciate it. Uh, the idea for this build is it's not going to be a tree. You're not doing very good. I'm sorry to hear that. Is everything okay? You want to talk about it? Is we're going to have... Um, let me grab some blocks just so I can kind of... Give a rough idea of what I'm going for, right? Um, is it's going to be a vine... Um, that's spiraling all the way up. Right? And, you know, it's gonna have texture and everything. Um. But it's gonna end up looking something like this. With layers overlapping each other, you know? Yeah, I have to watch anime in a week. I see. Um, there's a simple solution. Just, uh, forego your worldly responsibilities and watch anime i see nothing wrong i can go poorly at this uh let's make this a little bit thicker but like these stripes are basically going to wrap around this whole thing right and that's going to be what we're working on today it happens to have leaves on it no no no, no. it's gonna be more of a vine like a beanstalk almost so you do sometimes smart um, brush set sphere. Let's go with, uh, red underscore concrete. Let's do radius. Th uh, we'll go with radius two for now. I did that backwards. Let's go three. I'm going to. Yeah. Mask. Air. Now let's do this one with orange concrete. Mask. 
Mask air. Do yellow concrete. Mask air. Okay. Remember when I said radius three? That's way too much. <laughs> Let's set it to two. Uh, nope. Mmm, that's still probably a bit much, but we'll go with it for now. Find orange. It's not orange. Let's set that to two. And red. Oh, you don't have Netflix or Hulu, I see. Yeah, that will be rough. Um, I'm not going to condone pirating, but pirating is always an option, right? <laughs> I'm a good person. So you kind of get the, the idea that I'm going for, right? Like there's going to be several vines that are wrapping around each other. You own the anime you've watched? Oh, I believe it. Right? This looks like crap, but you know. Nothing left to undo. Ah. Pirate all my streams? Damn. I can't believe you do this to me, Beft. Uh, welcome to the stream, H-Bomb. How's it going? It's all good. How are you doing today? All right, we're going to... Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. No revenue. SMH my head. Slash slash cylinder. What brings you by? We'll go with blue concrete. And let's make it. What was the cylinder command? Minus. Oh, does minus H make it hollow? I should really know this. Some builder that I am. Let's go with uh, radius 15, height 60 for now. Let's go. I do know what I'm doing. Scrolling through Twitch and found you. I made that radius way too big. <laughs> I think it's the goal. So right now I am working on the lobby for our next minigame. I thought I set this to 15. Whoops. That's better. Um, yeah, basically the idea is there's going to be a vine. This is still too big, I think, but we're going to kind of just wrap our way up around it. Um, and it's going to look very vine like. Harder than you originally thought. Good luck, Sig. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um. Slash slash brush. Honestly, let's just grab an axe. That'd be quicker and easier. The hit game Among Us. I have maybe heard of Among Us. Yep. <laughs> Probably should have done one higher than that. Mm. Slash slash position two. Do do do. 
Position one. Oh, I put a space, that's what was wrong. Slash slash replace. Air. Cool. I have a saucy game. No way. I appreciate the work, H bomb. Hope you have a good rest of your day. All right. Let's go with, um, for now. We'll go 10. My thinking is if we do this, we'll have more flexibility in giving it a shape, right? Because it doesn't have to be right up against the wall. Honestly, I think I'm doing this in a kind of a dumb way. Am I doing this in a dumb way? No, because I need the tech. I need the shape, right? Because I need there to be the depth that you'll get from the different layers. This is going to be a lot of trial and error. So, um, hope you're ready for that. I don't like how much those blend. All you're gonna say is what? That's not, okay, hold on, hold on a little. That was convenient. By the way, is anybody, exactly, okay. So everybody watched, um, hey, Yak, thank you so much for the. Thank you so much for the resub. I appreciate it. Uh, what's this? This is a creative build for the lobby for the next mini game that I'm working on. What kind of message is hi. He's just saying hi. What's wrong with that? His, your messages aren't showing up, Mr. Unicorn? Huh. Um... I can see your messages, Mr. Unicorn. I don't know why they're, um... Not being posted. I mean, I, I do know why they're being posted. Why they aren't. I don't know how to allow it. Maybe you have to be in Twitch. Am I tripping? You might be. Oh. Are they being posted now, Mr. Unicorn? It looks like it. Can everybody see what Mr. Unicorn's saying? Uh, basically, Mr. Unicorn, I share a ban list with um, Octorok, and you're banned in Octorok's stream, apparently. So, <laughs> yep. They are. That was a mistake. Hey, that's between you and Octorok. Oh, 
I'm a child. I'm a child at heart, Yak. I'm a child at heart. You've been unbanned from their chat? Again, that's between you and Octorok. <laughs> I don't share a ban list with him, it just lets me know when... People from my chat, you know. Aren't we all, honestly? You accidentally shared your age, so Octorok banned you for that? Seriously? <laughs> it's funny. Oh, Twitch does it automatically? Octa unbanned you? I see. Rush error. Five. Sphere. Do, 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 do. Just gonna start over real quick. Um, Captoni made a TikTok. I made a TikTok a long time ago, Yak, before you even knew about me. I've had this TikTok for like over a year now. Nobody's just posted anything to it, so, you know. It definitely seems like a type to not have a TikTok. Yeah, I made a TikTok. So, one of my moderators said that he'd be posting funny clips and stuff for my Twitch to. Um, you'd take the clips from my Twitch and post them, right? He never did that. <laughs> so here we are. I have no idea what the best way to approach this would be. Because I feel like the shapes end up looking really wonky. Could be by doing just 180 different spheres or uh, cylinders and then individually texturing from there. That might be better. Cylinder, that's the command. You gonna follow the TikTok? Um, I again, I, I don't use TikTok, so <laughs> I doubt I'll see your face, Yak. Let's go with twenty. Um, and one. Then let's go up a block. You knew it. Yep. You still work at the pizza place? I do, yeah. It's your favorite pizza? Um, it's a good question. I go back and forth. Um. I like a variety of pizzas, I guess. I don't have one definitive favorite. Um, typically, if I'm ordering something for myself, it'll be pepperoni just because it's simple and easiest. But I like meat lovers. Um, chicken and bacon are good together. A lot of good options, you know? Pizza and Minecraft stream. Well, so fun story. Um, our build team actually just made a game <laughs> called Kitchen Burnout, where you can where you can actually make pizza in Minecraft. It's crazy, I know. How do I join? 
Uh, they were doing a playtesting session yesterday, actually. This is gonna have some weird, yeah. Sundu two. Hey, open back H bomb. How's it going? We're trying a different strategy. <laughs> so, uh, what I was doing before did not look great. Am I pizza myself? No, I'm. I'm not. I'm not pizza. Um, we're gonna have to do a lot of texturing by hand. Also, I messed something up. No, I didn't, because we bent it. Right. Let's just go up one. A child that likes pizza. Like I said, I'm a child at heart, you know? Try add some glazed terracotta for texturing. This isn't going to stay blue. Uh, basically... I'm going to go through and replace it with world edit. Um, what's probably going to happen is I'm going to just like go through and do this all the way up it. Right. And then from there, we'll change it to greens or whatever color we end up designing, deciding that the vine is going to look like. Right. But this is basically how we're going to individually like um, make these vines pop. Right. By giving them a little bit of depth from each other. We have this guy right here. Not a block in sight. But right now we're we're just building up the large structure of it, I think, is what at least we're pretending to do. <laughs> By the way, uh you accidentally found ancient debris. Congratulations, I think. Um Without giving any spoilers for people who haven't seen it, who here has seen the first episode of She-Hulk? What's up, Sheriff? What's that? It's the newest Marvel um, TV series. Who is pinging me? Oh, I see. The first episode is out now, yeah. This unicorn. What's up, Catlios? <laughs> Why are you booing? See you when you get home. Nice. Hope you enjoy it. How's it going, Sheriff? Like three days. Ah, good luck. Hope you have a good stream. I will try my best, Sheriff. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Also, I'll see you in the battlefield tomorrow. <laughs> Blunky Live, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Um, I'm going to replace those real quick with blue terracotta so I don't accidentally uh, world edit them at the same time. I forgot about the recovery compass. So nobody's watched She-Hulk yet? It's just me? Okay. Never mind. Ignore me. The end credit scene is the best part of the, the show. Easily. <laughs> easily the best part. So make sure you watch that. No nerd? Oh, I'm sorry, Sig. You're being a good student right now and only watching Twitch streams instead of... <laughs> Watching Marvel TV. Let's 
It's gonna have some whack shape to it. Um. All right, let's pretend like this is permanent, right? And just go through like this. This is a, uh, this is not ideal right here. For the first three weeks, oh yeah, yeah, yeah I believe it's like. Can I say a bad word? Um, depends how bad we're talking. All right, these have turned very vertical very quickly. Ah, uh, good luck, Creeper. Don't die. You just did? Oh, well. That's on you. Should have AFK'd somewhere safer. Starts with C and ends with M. Hmm. Whatever, we'll just, just move on to the next one. Uh, let me cut this one back. Chameleon doesn't end with an M, chat. <laughs> Hold on. At Y61? I believe you can find them at um, any Y level, technically. Camel? Camel doesn't end with an M either. What are you guys on? This is looking really whack. I don't know if I like this. I really don't want to have to build this by hand, but like, that honestly might be the best way to do it. Which, um... We'll see. Try using the curve tool. Is there a curve tool? Oh yeah, no, there is. You're right. There definitely is. Can you do a, a curve tool? I know you have to like set three points, right? But how thick can you make a curve? Or does each curve have to be individually calculated? Or like automatically uses spheres, does it? You get high and drunk on air, that's crazy. Okay, let's uh let's test this out. Let's just do um position one. Position two. Then do I stand at the middle point? Is that how curves work? Slash curve with convex polyhedral selections. Is there a slash slash position three? No. You have to use slash slash cell convex on your wand. Left click equals first vertex. Okay.
Uh, <laughs> um, I have somehow created the letter N. <laughs> Um, I don't know. <laughs> um, Yeah, that's smart. Uh, one, and then one, I need to set their positions. All right, and then what was it? Was it left click equals first vertex? So do I have to be looking at a block? Is that how that works? Make a selection first, bro. I. Um, I don't understand this witchcraft. You made a new selection? Yeah, I okay, so I select point one, right? Added a vertex. How did that oh my gosh? Started a new selection with vertex. Oh. So that's point one. Added vertex. Uh, no. I see how it works. Hey, what's up, Quacklip? How's it going? We are trying to figure out world edit things Are you using left mouse bumper or button for place maybe i figured it out don't worry and if i wanted it to be thicker is there a way to do that yes there is oh this changes things okay Let's get rid of all of this. And, uh, um, Amagus. Hey, what's up, Amorous? How's it going? So, how do I change the axe to being back to an axe, you know? Slash so slash position one. See, that, that sets a vertex again. So, how do I change it? off of a vertex just use another axe sick thank you ketlios for being awesome Thank you, Amherst, for your contribution. Contribution. Okay, so now we go back to convex. That's what it was. Okay. What's cult of the lamb? What Catlio said. That was fast, honestly. 
Um, it's the hub, but what's the build? Um, it's a good question, Quack. Um, I'm I'm not gonna go too into detail because I don't want to give away spoilers. Um, but currently we're starting with a big freaking vine. <laughs> Hold up, I have a question. Oop. 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 Um. Can I go like that? Okay, I can. And this is, this is hollow, right? Yo, this is sick. Oh my gosh. Do you know how much time and effort this would have saved me in? <laughs> other things that I've built. Holy crap. Okay, this is sick. This is insane, Ketlios. Like, pff. we're gonna move this. We're gonna move these in a little bit. This has changed my life. I probably shouldn't be using glass because, like, other things would make this so much easier, but. Pff. Or easier to see, right? While building. Um, but it's fine. Uh, Quack Club, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Also, uh, congrats on the build trial, by the way. Alright, let's just start here. I probably should have started smaller, but you know, here we are. Have a good one, Creeper. Thanks for being here. I'm ready for my computer to erupt in flames after I run this command, by the way. Should be pretty cool. Hey, what's up, Bandale? How's it going? Your fly speed higher? Is there a way to do that without mods? That's a thing with world edit, is it? <laughs> Alright, curve, blue, concrete, 50. I forgot to make it hollow. Do you know how much time and energy this has just saved me? <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, let's bump it up to 18 and let's make it hollow. All right, guys, chat. If Connor shows up or any of the other command realm people, tell them I built this by hand because it's going to freak them out and it's going to be hilarious. Eight year hub building. <laughs> now about the curve. Uh, don't worry about cut the S. It's a big vine. It is going to be a big vine eventually, yeah. All right, let's undo this real quick so we can have glass go all the way up to the top, but I really like the shape. How have you been, Andiel? What have you been up to? I haven't seen you in a bit. Yes, you have. It's been like a week, okay? It's probably been more than a week, actually. I take that back. Every goddamn stream. Yep, you're not wrong. I'm pretty sure I made that joke last time. I don't like the um, joint there, I think. <laughs> 
Sauce Girl still simping for me? I haven't seen Sauce Girl in a while. Like, longer than I've seen Andiel, you know? So. So how do I set my, my speed with the uh, world edit? Oh my gosh, I cannot believe that this is a thing. This is crazy. Oh. How does it look from the inside? You'll send for me? Aw, oh, thanks, Andiel. I don't have my uh, Fulbright mod on. Installed. There's fog up there. That's crazy. It was on 12 hours ago. She owes you 100k. What did she owe you 100k for? Digging? How much did you dig out? Cat Leos, you have literally changed my life. You have no idea how much time you you have saved me. Uh, I've already forgotten what the command was. Cell cuboid. And again, if Connor, specifically if Connor shows up chat, this was all built by hand. I forgot to make it. On a server with essentials that enables it. Hmm, interesting. Good to know. Still got pride spirit. I don't know what that means, but sure. Why are you breaking all that by hand? Because sometimes it feels nice to break things by hand, Andiel. You know? Shut up. Uh... Alright, so what I'm thinking... Now... Is we go up like this and we're just gonna connect the dots around this and use a smaller radius Although, I feel like it should, near the bends, right, warp a little bit. Apparently your orbit plush is on the way. Ooh, is mine on the way? I haven't seen anything about that, Volga. Time flies. <laughs> yeah, it's been like a year since I've made a map too, Andiel. I helped out on Kitchen Burnout, but like, I did very little. Don't they ship in September? I have no idea. You got an email? Here, hold up. I'm checking my spam folder right now. Oh, I got the, the email as well. Order is on the way.
It's been a year, Andiel? That's crazy. It has been a while for me as well. I'm going to accidentally miss one of these and it's going to end up looking really funky. Or one. It's been about a year since Origin Realms released. I'm pretty sure. Imagine calculating all of this by hand. Ugh. Why are you subbed to her? Couldn't tell you. It's gonna look weird if it goes down. And like under. Right after the start of 2021. Almost two years, damn. Um, if I had to guess, it's probably gift subs, Yak. Unless you're talking about you on YouTube, then Psh, couldn't tell you. Are you building a tree? It's more of a vine, Amherst. I think. Um, yeah, that's kind of the plan, Quacklib. Kind of. <laughs> Select them as you place them? You know, nobody asked you. Yes, it would be fast. <laughs> uh, yep, hundred percent would have been faster. <laughs> Here we are now. <laughs> yep. You couldn't have said this like, I don't know, 10 minutes ago when I started placing them. Also, 386.22. 386.22, okay. Did I get that one? No. On eBay, Yak? Um, what? If you misclick, does anyone know? <laughs> Couldn't tell ya. I have no idea, Ketlios, apparently. 
All right, so now it is slash slash curve. Say red concrete uh, minus H. Um, G mask air. Yeah, that's fine. Red concrete. Say five is going to be too much. We'll say two and let's say, oh, that's just it, right? All right. That's pretty sick. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is going to save me so much time. I missed a glass block over here, but that's not the end of the world. This is so cool. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right. Is there a way that I can, I don't think there is. Uh, there, wait, it'd be like, be this. It's so little time. Yeah, neither can I, Quacklib. This is crazy. <laughs> All right, I want to quickly test before we get ahead of ourselves. How this looks. My <laughs> Jesus. Um I'll speak curve. That should not be five, it should be two. Okay, so there's a few gaps. I need to be careful with my placement is the main thing. Basically, we need to make sure we're within two blocks, I think, right? So we need that. We might have to go through manually and add some. Even then, it's probably not a big deal if there are gaps, right? It's probably not a big deal. New selection, boop, 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 and boop. Is there a way to make it so that every time I place a block, it automatically <laughs> does the thing doubt it unfortunate um I feel like I did one of these out of order, but it doesn't look like it because that's going in vertical order, right? 28, 33, 36, 40, 43, 47, 52, 57, 61. It's probably fine. We'll just keep going. Worst comes to worst, we just reselect everything. This is literally just Pepsi colors right now. Okay, hold on. Can we just do this slash slash replace? Not replace, sorry. Okay, for the most part, this looks like pretty solid placement. Even the gap, I, I think I'm fine with the gaps existing, honestly.
increasing the radius a bit. Could do that. But ideally, right, we're leaving as much space on the inside as possible because I want this to stay hollow or reasons that will maybe become clear later. Probably not. <laughs> yeah, it, it does become very chunky very quickly as well. Like I said, I, I'm not like a huge. I, I'm not going to have a big problem with there being. Gaps, I think. Because once like it's not going to stay blue, the, the blue will be changed color and everything, so it should end up being fine. Are you going to do this alternating right around the vine? Basically, yeah, we have a, a the we're going to do yellow, basically, or we'll do three colors, red, orange, yellow, red, orange, yellow, red, orange, yellow, all the way around. Um, basically, I want there to be enough space so that way I can come through with like a radius three brush, radius four, maybe occasionally, um, and texture it that way later on. And the more like space and colors that we have, the more options we'll have. Really good for making terrain. Why didn't you tell me this when I first started Volgo? Now we're in too deep. I just deleted one of my brushes. Actually, it's not even a big deal. We're not, probably not going to use that brush anymore. This isn't terrain SMH. Could be. Nobody asked you. Gosh. I'll go. We miss you. Who is we? That statement concerns me. <laughs> you asked yourself. That's a dangerous game to play, Volgo. You and your unicorns? Okay. I oh, you were about to say sauce girl. I was about to be like, mmm. Mmm. I don't know about that. Yeah, no, I know that it does, Quacklib. Um I just didn't want to have to think about what it was. It was a wood sword, so it doesn't even matter. But yeah, and even then. I doubt we're going to end up using it anymore because this is so much better. Oh my gosh, Volga, you sound like Calvin. <laughs> and your alarm didn't go off? That um, seems like a problem. What do you do? Get a fire extinguisher? Call the fire department? I don't know. Flash G mask. Air, comma, glass. I put a space in there. Fine now? Okay. Glad that it's fine now. 
Something I didn't think about. Which may come back to bite me. Is... I don't know if there's enough even spacing. Some of the vines are going to have to end up being thicker than others, right? Uh, in certain areas, at least. Because... <laughs> Right here, right? There's like a really big gap. I don't know. We'll see. But for the most part, this looks pretty good. I'm pretty happy with it. I feel like there are a couple areas where I want to smooth it, uh, smooth it out, but I think it's pretty good. I like it. I, I especially like the, the vines that go underneath, but yeah. All right, time to do this like 900 more times. <laughs> Uh, boop. boop. We might end up doing four colors because I feel like there's going to be some places where... They might end up getting really close. Mostly though. So, uh, how's everybody doing? AMA time, I guess. <laughs> Anybody, uh, anybody have any fun stories? Doing schoolwork though. Fair. For your farm realm, nice. What do you mean by ideas like creative projects or like creating farms? You know? You got a fun story? Let's hear it. No, I just started to do vertex because I misclicked. How far? We're more than halfway. We're just going to place all these and uh, we'll come back. Rest in peace, yeah. Honestly, something you could try out. Well, making the radius commands bigger might be a bit of a pain. Hmm. Okay, he morphed into a banana. I feel like most people are smart enough to understand that some sort of trick is a, you know, being used. Most people. Yeah.
my <laughs> one of my favorite memories from uh, my first few years in college was a buddy of mine. A couple of my friends run on um, Omegle, right? Oh, this is a horrible story. I should not be telling this. Um, and one of my buddies, who's a little overweight, <laughs> was. Um, was getting made fun of by like a bunch of teenage girls and they were like calling him Shamu. It's horrible. I feel really bad telling this story now. Um, anyways, moral of the story is Omega's a effed up place. Sounds like every other Omega story. Yeah, that's true. Alright, new selection. No misclicking. It's seriously bad. I agree. 100%. That's pretty cool, Volga. Um, I saw on Reddit, it was three triplets, right? On Omegle. And they had this routine where one of them would run down the hall, throw his hat backwards. Another one would catch it, run down the hall, throw his hat backwards. Uh, or like the, it, each time when they would get to the end of the hall, they'd like say hi to the camera or whatever. And they'd be like, watch this. And it would repeat like on loop, right? Um... But each time was different. They would say something new and people were like freaking out. Like, what the hell? But he's always like throwing a hat and his brother's catching it. And the, basically the illusion was that there's three of them and they're just running in circles. And <laughs> it looked really funny and really clean. Yeah, I agree, Volgo. I really wish that I had um, an identical twin. Do some a lot, a lot of really dumb things. At Tal, get your alt account out of here, or I will ban it. How do I undo one selection? So slash slash undo selection. You can't. I have sleepovers and play Xbox. That's pretty cool. Build fortresses. I did it again. Made him sad. Vault Tal. I know that both accounts are you. It's not funny. All right, we need to pay more attention to this one. Uh, oh my crap. 
try because this isn't going to work out. I'm going to have to start over. There's some really jank geometry here. But I think for the most part, it works. The other trouble area was down here, I think. Yeah, for the most part, it works. Alright, now the question is, should we have... Should we have all of the vines going in the same direction? What are we building? We're building a big vine. I just googled vines and it took me to the freaking website. <laughs> I think if we do vines going in the opposite direction, like against the thing, right? Um, we make them thinner, make them radius one instead. Needs more vines. Well, no dir. It's not done. <laughs> I just want to know what you thought, Connor. It's not done. Like the. There's going to be more vines wrapping up it. I'm just trying to think of things to differentiate it. Because it's going to get kind of boring, I think, relatively quickly if... Looks great. Aw, thanks. For people who bought both Java and Bedrock before they could be bought together. Um... So, yeah, I had a couple questions about that, Volgo, because, like, if you had Java, like, back in, like, 2017, you got Bedrock for free. Something a long time ago. I don't know what. Turned out really good. Yep, all by hand. I mean, the, these guys were obviously, like, sphere tools. Um, but the, the blue thing, all by hand. Yeah, um, I think it's cool, honestly. I like that they're branching out and giving us more capes. Um, <laughs> and it's actually going to be like a, a somewhat rare cape, right? It, it's going to be a lot rarer than the migrator cape, right? So, I think it's kind of cool. Would I use it? Probably not, because I got a cooler cape. <laughs> but, I think it looks pretty cool. You believe you'll get it? Congratulations. If I have the Xbox edition, does that count from... You know, like 10 years ago? <laughs> He brought both versions though. Um, you can sign them in to both of them being Microsoft account or tie them both to your Microsoft account, right? Honestly, my Xbox account, which was tied to my, which is tied to my Microsoft account. 
um, from like eight years ago or whatever. Uh, if that counts, that might work. You bought Pocket Edition at some point? Well, fair. But Pocket Edition's separate from Bedrock now, isn't it? Or are they the same? You have Java, you get Bedrock for free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, basically, they're saying you have to have purchased like multiple things of Minecraft before a certain date and you can get it or something. I don't know. Pocket Edition is part of Bedrock now? Okay. So then, fair. <sighs> Do you think Oscar would get upset, Connor, if I messaged him and I was like, hey, question. <laughs> How's this going to work? He'd probably be like, who the f are you? <laughs> Who's that? Oscar is the guy who runs the realms program. I've talked to him once. He's very scary. Everybody's scared of him. Did I? I'm just gonna start over. I don't even know anymore. He's actually a really nice person. It's just whenever we have to message him because we aren't sure about something, we always like draw straws <laughs> to see who's going to message him. Because we're always like, you know, they're important people and we're, we're not really as important. <laughs> so it's, it's intimidating, you know. You're more important? Keep telling yourself that, Volgo. <laughs> Maybe someday it'll come true. Uh, you've made a lot of maps for realms and are kind of known in that community. Um, Basically, I, I don't know what their messaging process looks like. Um... Like, uh, or how somebody would get a hold of them if they aren't in the realms program, uh, as in today, could be Volgo. Probably not, though. <laughs> uh, but once you're in the realms program, right? Um, typically, I think once they start, like, if you get Cape credit, you get added to the Slack. There's a few other requirements, I think. Um, but Slack's like a more professional Discord, right? And that's where they run, run things from. Um, and you can message them from there, basically. Oh, by the way, for those of you who don't know, tomorrow we're going to be doing a big multiverses competition with some streamer friends. Um, it's going to be 2v2, um, Visionary and I versus Narfi and Sheriff. And it should be pretty fun, pretty hype. We might be do some channel point bets, you know, 
So, if that at all interests you, that's a thing that's going to be happening. I have no idea what you're saying, Yak, I'm going to be honest. This thing's so tall. <laughs> Whose idea was this? Oh, is an Origin Realms mod named the Jester? Huh, interesting. Um, I didn't know that. This is so tedious. Uh, but here we are. Almost finished with the fourth vine. All right, uh, let's make this one. Purple. I don't want to do green because green's the color that we're going to end up making it eventually, I think. Um, so I'd like to keep green out of the palette for now. And I want to do blue because that's the base color that I chose for some reason. <laughs> Magenta? It's too late. It's already been chosen. There's a lot of gaps in here. I might go through by hand and fill in some of those. For the most part, pretty cool, pretty cool. There's a really big gap there. I'm gonna have to touch that up. Okay, right. not bad, not bad. Oh my gosh. I'm just imagining how far we would be if we didn't have the curve tool and it's not very far. I was looking from the inside out of curiosity. All right, that's kind of cool, not gonna lie. I like how it like starts with very little and then it becomes more and more and more. This is a really cool effect. Also, does this go straight up? From right here, it does. He built my hand, yeah. <laughs> what curve tool? <laughs> Facts. 
All right, we're gonna we're not actually gonna do this, but we're gonna put a dropper in here. <laughs> you know how funny that would be? You can't even see the bottom from up here. <laughs> we. I re oh my gosh, I wish I knew about this so much sooner. This is crazy. You played the dropper on Hypixel? Um, maybe? I couldn't tell you off the top of my head, Vago, honestly. I have a bug bite on the back of my leg, and oh my gosh, it feels so good to scratch it. <laughs> Someone stop stopped me. It got added recently? Oh, then definitely not. We, is like is there enough space to maneuver and fly up through this? Uh not really. It's scuffed, but kind of fun. What do you mean by scuffed? How do you scuff a dropper? <laughs> like what? Dropper's like the, the simplest game to make in Minecraft. How do you scuff up a dropper map? There's way too few maps. I mean, does that really make it scuffed? Only like 22. That's a decent amount. Pretty repetitive using world edit <laughs> <It'd> be funny <laughs> what would be cool hold on let me let me grab um Let's grab, uh, uh, we'll do magenta for now. But like having little guys just coming along like this, right? And then popping out like this. Ooh, that's really cool. I'm going to keep that for now. Um, just to remind me. But that's gonna be really cool. So this is a voting system. I hate. Okay, I don't hate. I strongly dislike uh, mini games with voting systems for maps specifically, right? Where the map heavily influences the game, right? Um, for games like Trouble in Mineville, it, the the map didn't matter too much, right? There was a couple traitor traps. Some maps got picked more than others, obviously, but like for the most part, it was pretty fine, pretty whatever. There were a couple dumb maps. Um, but like for a dropper, like the, the whole gameplay is based off of voting or based off of like what map you get. I feel like having a vote system for that is kind of dumb. have map voting it's probably good i don't know i don't play high pixel i don't play any many uh minecraft mini games anymore outside of minigame mash which by the way tomorrow if you like minecraft mini games i'm going to be streaming minecraft mini games on a different twitch channel so you know be sure to join my discord check it out 
It's going to be on Sticky Pistons Twitch channel. So, you know. There's that. Used to play Bed Wars a lot. I, I definitely went through a Bed Wars phase. I, I was a big fan of Bed Wars at one point, but it, it kind of fell off for me. The, the only game I really ever play now on iPixel is Build Party. And even then, I, I don't play that all that often. How's it going so far? Uh, pretty well. So, Calvin, we uh, basically we built the blue section by hand and we've been doing sphere tools for these little um, these little veins going up it. And eventually I'm going to like, you know, break them down and texture them and all that. But this is where we're at so far. How tall is the final thing going to be? This is how tall the vine's going to be. Uh, basically, I went on a realm and tested how tall you can see or how high you can see. Um, I did not expand the world height. No, this is Y0 here and Y180 up there. It's a little taller than Y180. Y180. Um, but this is about as tall as you can see with the uh, realm's render distance. So... Yeah. This is as tall as the vine's gonna be. Yeah. Like I said, this is as tall as it's gonna be, so. Won't be taller. And I, I made sure that I could see from bottom to top. Uh, what's really trippy though, is when you're up at the top from the inside, like the floor just barely start stops rendering. <laughs> We're gonna put a dropper in here. I've decided. <laughs> I, I don't, I'm, I'm not committing to that by any means, but it's pretty cool and trippy. But yeah, you'll be able to see the top. No worries. They move again. <laughs> I've been falling for 30 minutes. I'd have said it louder if my roommate wasn't asleep. <laughs> That's probably my favorite MCU quote right there. <laughs> At Calvin and Connor, have you guys seen uh, She-Hulk yet? Out of curiosity, first episode. Yeah, uh, no spoilers for people who haven't seen it. Obviously, it seemed interesting. Yeah, I, I thought it was alright. It was better than I expected. Nope. The end credit scene, though, best part of it. Best part of it was the end credit scene. <laughs> So for those of you who haven't seen it, the end credit scene, worth it. Great actors. Oh yeah, for sure. The cast is great so far. I'm excited to see where it goes. Like you said last night, we didn't talk about this last night. Oh, you weren't there. Wow. Okay. Thanks, Calvin. <laughs> He's watched Severance yet? No. <laughs> nope. Pretty much all my free time has been on Twitch, on like literally streaming Volgo. <laughs> I haven't watched anything. Will be recurring. Who knows? She's getting the good place. I haven't seen it, but I will take your word for it.
Really good show. Take your word for it. Alrighty. We. And back up we go. Did I get that one? Oh, shit. Okay, we got it. What do you have to Calvin? And Connor, if you're still here. This is cool new hand building. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm not doing the vines by hand. I already said that. But the, the big blue vine, I did that by hand. Coding. Ooh. Are you coding for unnamed Minecraft minigame by Command Realm, Connor? Go to sleep before 7 a.m. tonight. Makes sense, makes sense. <laughs> have a good night, Calvin. Thanks for being here. Nice. It is data pack coding, yep. Played some different games. What kind of games do you play, Calvin? Get good at Enter the Gungeon. Fair enough. I want to get good at Cult of the Lambs. <laughs> Wanted to for a long time. Makes sense. I hear it's a fun game. A geometry dash. You finished? Yeah, Hollow Knight's absolutely amazing. I love that game. Uh, I've been really tempted to boot it up again and try and 100% it. I'm not going to because that sounds painful. Um, but yeah, I've, I've been tempted to. Had it for two years. Oh, it's definitely worth it. That's fine. Did I hack up? Hold on. Oh no, I messed up. I made it too tall. I added 64 blocks to the... So I started it at Y0, right? And I was like 180 blocks tall. And then I was like, I need to add 64 blocks to it. I made it too tall! That's fine, we can cut off part of it. Uh... You should really use your switch. It's pretty cool. Switch is switch is fun, you know. I use mine occasionally. Nova Drift as well. Fair enough. I want to get good at Minecraft. Have you heard of it?
outside of Minecraft. Fair enough, Calvin. Makes sense, Calvin. Well, this is going to take a lot of work. Uh, I'm pretty happy with the progress so far. For two hours worth of work, this is, I think this is pretty good, you know? Behind NES Maker. Huh, that's cool. In Unity or something? Hey, you know, if you want to mod something in Unity, I think um, that's what BDSP runs on. The new uh, Pokemon Diamond Pearl, uh, Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. They run on Unity. And there is some crazy mods coming out for that game. So, you know, if, if you're looking for something to mod, there's that. New project entirely. Well, I, I'm just saying, just keep your options open. <laughs> Should make a cool hack for Pokemon. Mod Minecraft? Oh, gross. <laughs> You ever finished? Interesting, gotcha. I feel like I should try and have some of these guys, these um, vines, overlap with each other. Like, intertwine. You made ducks? Cool. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> Where's Y180 out of curiosity? That is right there. You made a mod with ducks. Oh, for Minecraft. I understand now. That's cool, Calvin. All right, let's grab a block that'll stand out. We'll say Sea Lantern. That's easy. Puzzle game in Unity. Nice. I haven't made anything in Unity. Because I'm not a nerd. I'm so disappointed that part of this is going to get cut off. <laughs> oh, well. What we'll probably do at some point is like, just remove everything from like here to here. Maybe not this area because it's on a lower. Right, we'll, we'll stay over here, right? Remove it like all of the yellow and purple from here, right? I just realized that's Lakers colors. Gross. Anyways, remove the yellow and purple from here and have them swap, right? And then change all of the yellow going up and all the purple going up. And then have them like overlap each other. That could be kind of cool. 2084 on your TI-84. Nice. <laughs> Why? Is that bored in your math classes? Wow. 
Imagine learning things. Weird. Anyways, I'm going to wrap up stream here. Thanks for watching. Um, I might work on this tomorrow night. Mario Rose platformer. Make your own level by editing matrices. Was, huh, that's cool. There's um, uh, a fan-made game called, I think it's called Mario Multiverse, where you can make your own levels. Um, you can choose the mario style and it tries to emulate the physics from the original game it's not perfect um but it has a lot more options and things you can do than mario maker can which is kind of cool i think it kind of fell off though how did sign good levels oh i see Anyways, I'm going to wrap up stream here. It's midnight for me. Um, I have to be up somewhat early tomorrow. Um, but, for those of you who don't know, tomorrow is Minigame Mash. We're going to be streaming some minigames over at twitch.tv slash stickypiston. Here is the link to it. Um, and if you want a notification of when that starts, I'll ping my Discord and Command Realm as well. Um... On top of that, we will, or so minigame mash, we play a bunch of minigames with viewers, right? It's pretty cool, pretty chill, fun time, you know? Yep. <laughs> In 3D on a calculator? Yeah, I don't blame you. Rendering, thing, rendering things in 3D on a calculator sounds like cheeks. Um. <laughs> Anyways. Um, thanks everybody for watching. I will see you all later. See you all soon. Don't really have anything else to say, so yeah. A reminder app. Nice. <laughs> um, yeah, have a good one, everybody. Thanks for being here, and I will see you all later. Deuces. Also, shoutouts to Ketlios for making my life a million times easier. Thank you so much. <laughs> See you, everybody. Bye.